Hi, Rick again. I uh, am wanting to share some information with you about gloved hands and importantly what, what this focus of this video will be about removing contaminated gloves without contaminating yourself. These are great. They can give you a barrier to protect you and your skin from a contaminated surface. But don't let these barriers give you false confidence. Once you've been handling a contaminated surface, the gloves are contaminated. The key to removing them, it seems like simple, oh, you just peel gloves off. But as an example of what you don't want to do, I got a dirty glove and I go like this and I grab that and now I've contaminated this portion of my arm with this contaminated thumb. So you do not want to do what you normally would think of as just grabbing it and peel. So. Here is the process for contaminated glove removal. You grab a glove, the, the wrist here, but on the glove itself, and you begin to peel, and you peel it like this, always avoiding touching your skin. And you'll notice the glove inverts inside out. That's totally good, because now, theoretically, that material is further into the glove. But before I pull that all the way off, what I do is I just grab the glove, and let and gather that into my gloved hand and now I have a contaminated glove inside there. Now here's the trick is with your ungloved hand you don't want to grab uh, the glove area because it's contaminated anywhere so what you do then is you come underneath the glove to your skin and again pull that glove up touching the inside, let it reverse itself, and now I have two gloves contaminated and I can drop them away. Boom! That's it. Think about not touching surfaces with contaminated surfaces. It's about maintaining that barrier integrity. That's it. Bye.